to show you here on our Sutter Butte Sky Cam 3 Network camera. Again, if you smell the smoke where you live, you feel it in the back of your throat, your lungs, you're probably breathing in unhealthy amounts of smoke. It's recommended to limit your outdoor activities. Most of the valley today should be smoke free for the afternoon, midday hours. The foothills, however, especially from El Dorado County north through Placer County, especially, and into Sierra Nevada counties, we could experience a lot of smoke today. Temperatures in the valley, upper 80s today, tomorrow about 87 with a few clouds here. Thunderstorm is possible today and tomorrow, but look at the, uh, the rest of the week. 90s for Monday and Tuesday, and then 80s to even 70s by the end of the week. A cool down is coming our way. All right, Eileen, thank you. And after week long competition among Sacramento area restaurants featuring the California King Salmon, the votes have been tallied. And dun 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 dun, <laughs> Frank Fats comes out the winner this morning. Forbidden Wild Salmon. Is what uh, got that crown for them. Good morning to you. Thanks Absolutely. so much for being with us, and congratulations to you, Mike Lim, Thank you. executive chef from Frank Fats, joined us this morning. I love this forbidden wild salmon. What makes yes, it forbidden? We mm -hmm. have to know. We well, know. the secret ingredient is the forbidden black rice. Um, now, it is, uh, it is the star of the dish is the king salmon, but uh, uh, the rice, as we tasted earlier, um, really yeah. has specific flavor. You just gave us away. Eileen and I <laughs> may or may not have already done a taste test. So that's amazing. Now tell us about forbidden rice, where it comes from, where we can get it. Well, you can get it at your local Asian market. Okay. Um, uh, it is indigenous to uh, Asia. Thailand has it. China has it. So, but, uh, um, you know, this is actually... Um, you mixed it with a little something. We did. Basically, I mixed it with a little bit of sesame oil, but that's it. We're going to let the natural flavors of the rice kind of carry that through. So it's just a really good accompaniment to the salmon here. And I'm actually just finished cooking that. So. It's kind of a mix, too, between a short grain and a long grain. Um, it's a little bit sticky, which is what Eileen and I like. It is sticky. Well. Uh, it is considered uh, sticky rice. So. Okay, since we are supposed to be talking about yes. salmon here. Let's, let's, <laughs> let's cook the dish. And then about some yummy rice. Yeah, let's cook the dish. I have a little bit of baby bok choy going on here. Also, uh, Woo! a little but... Uh, also called baby, uh, baby bok choy sum, okay. but uh, our king salmon here. I've had this going on for a little bit now uh, because we want to render um, all that uh, fat in the, uh, on the bottom there and crisp the skin. That's really what uh, mm. I like about keeping the skin on. So king salmon season is from now through the rest of the month, and correct, you're going to be correct, having this correct. dish we're making on your menu through the yes, rest of the month. Yes, Great. currently I have this on the lunch menu right now as a special. Uh, you can also get this in the larger portion uh, for dinner as an entree. Okay. Uh, the salmon ends right around the end of October, so I'm going to put it on the menu as long as I can get that. There you go. Yeah. Okay. So I got some bok choy going on. I didn't make a sauce here. I got some ingredients for the sauce, which uh, we're using some very beautiful heirloom tomatoes uh, from Ray Young Farms out in Yolo County. Uh, in the sauce, we have a little bit of lemongrass, ginger, uh, bay leaves, and garlic. So I have the sauce already pre-made here. I'll build a dish in a second, but um, on the salmon here, basically we have a little bit of our in-house seasoning. Uh, our in-house seasoning uh, has a little bit of uh, star anise, salt, white pepper, and a little bit of five spice. Okay. So that'll carry the salmon a little bit as well. The salmon's are already about halfway cooked. Um, we're going to flip it over just to finish it up here, and the skin should be nice and Okay. Crispy. Do you need this? Yes, absolutely. All right. We got the bok choy going on. The only thing I'm going to do with the bok choy, once again, uh, the same theme here. We're going to do a little bit of uh, sesame oil to flavor it. A couple of tosses and uh, a little bit of the seasoning salt as well. Now you already have the seasoning on the salmon. Correct. Did you I did more? that. I did, okay. No, I did that. We just, just have a, a few more, more seconds sure. left. I just want to make sure we get it all in. Uh, how long on the bok choy? Uh, the bok choy, you blanch it for maybe 30 seconds. Uh, get a little color on it, and the, and the what we would use in the the restaurant we'd use a wok, so uh, for this stainless steel, I mean uh, stainless steel or a Teflon pan is great. I'm gonna go ahead and build one of these dishes here uh, yep, for you good. as we go. We'll I got the box going going. Let me move the fortune cookies out of the way so our viewers can see. Okay. okay. As you, you can go, see, this, the skin is nice and crispy. That's what I'm looking for. Okay. So this is more of a composed dish, uh, as in it's got your rice, fish, uh, and a little bit of rice, uh, and, and the salmon, of course. Um, all together in one dish as opposed to an a la carte. Okay, we got 30 okay. seconds left, Mike. No I want to make sure this. Yeah, go ahead okay. and finish, finish that up no. there. Get that on the plate so right. everyone can see. Again, salmon season runs from May until September. The dish is on the Frank Fat menu until the end of the month. The restaurant, of course, is located in Old Sacramento. Go out there and get the dish. If while it lasts, mm. we're going to sink our teeth into this one <laughs> while we can get it. I have a feeling it's going to go away here fast, too. Looking beautiful. Beautiful display this morning. Congratulations again to you, Mike Lim and Frank Fast.
for being crowned the Salmon Week Competition Champion. Thanks for being here. Have a great day. The latest on the King Fire at 5.